wait the chicken rank now and it's about 8.15. It's so windy today. Well today I'm just gonna do like my usual workout session. Um, but tomorrow I'm getting up even earlier to go to a class. Um, well, it's a flexi stretch class, so it's just about stretching, so it's gotta be pretty calming. Uh oh, what to choose? Starbucks or the gym? Why did they have to place those two places next to each other? I'm done with my workout now um, so now it's time to throw myself at some work but first breakfast Day. I'm actually feeling a little bit uninspired these days. I guess it's because like I actually don't have that much clothes to choose from um, Since I came here because I only brought what I could have in a suitcase um, So I really feel like I need to go find some new clothes So that will be a project on my list not the worst project ever I'll say the weather seems to be like really Changing all the time right now. It looks okay, but it's just been raining all night seriously I could just hear it and it's pretty windy too, but it seems to be coming up. So I think there's like probably gonna be sun and then later again we'll probably have rain again. Also, I don't know what's wrong with my accent, please excuse me, but I guess it's a little bit like um, people tend to say I have a little bit of an American accent, especially here in England, they keep telling me that. But the longer I've been here, the more I feel like I'm taking on some words and some different you know kind of accents and way of saying it as they say it here in UK so honestly I just want to kind of like have my own accent that's just the Jenny accent you know um, <laughs> but I guess in school we learn American English so that's probably why my accent is a little more American than it's actually um, British but uh, you can definitely still hear that I'm a Dane at least all the Danish people can definitely hear that so I think that's fine to hold on to at least <laughs> get a salad sometimes I also have some good Danish rye bread on the side when it's possible to get it but this is like today no bread so instead I put an egg and some cottage cheese because it really fills me up and then there's this like sweet chili and that's kind of like the unhealthy part I would say because it really does contain a lot of sugar but honestly it's so good but you could definitely do without when I have um, my cottage cheese so actually what i've been meaning to talk to you about is actually this kind of danish english 
I have my blog by Jenny.dk, which is, uh, it started out as a Danish blog, and you know, it's still a Danish blog, but now I uh, translate everything, like every post I do, I write it in both Danish and in English, because I kind of want to have, like, I guess this broader audience, especially because I've been living in New York, like most of last year, and now I'm here in England, so in that way it makes sense. That's also what I'm thinking about now when I'm doing like these videos to actually do them in English because, as I said, I live in UK now, probably only for a limited time, but I get that um, Danish people might find it a little odd to hear me speak English and maybe even like a tad annoying because um, why not just speak in Danish when, you know, that's where I'm from. So, guys. What do you think? English or Danish? Mm -hmm.